Steve Kerry, Steve Kerry. Oh, it's an interception here. Henry Sharp having to check. Ben Barton coming across. He's going to out beside Ben Barton. He's going to go. He's going all the way. It snapped is the nail in the coffin. Henry Sharp. He, uh, he turns the tables this time. Beaten when Bremer Kebby scored, but he certainly showed him he can score a good try. Beating Ben Barton with some infinite skill on this right. Austin's the dummy half. This is the last tackle, and Halifax are running it. Hutchinson. Ball out to Sharp. Sharp's round, and he's sharp in the corner. He is. Oh, magnificent try, Henry Sharp. And the smile says it all. He went round David Nelson as though he wasn't there. Pushed the foot down on the pedal and skated in in the corner. Well, they elected to keep the ball alive. This is the last tackle. Then it goes out there to Bailey, onto Harkin. The long ball. The wind makes it go down. There you find Hutchinson sends it out wide. It hits the ground. But look at this man. Oh, dear me, David Nelson. He stood you up. Good play there indeed. That is a great try. And you talk about people being rooted because of the Twin Towers at Wembley. Then Mr. Nelson, take a look at this. Oh, you won't want to relive it. It was good play here by Henry Sharp. He made him look like a second rater, didn't he? And that's a great try. And look at the reaction on Henry Sharp's face. He knows that the big league cameras will quite easily be back here at Drum Hall next year. Great try. Fifth try of the season for Henry Sharp. Another big mistake from David Nelson. Southernwood to Harrison. Harrison gets it away to Southernwood. Southernwood's got a break on. Tackled by Bradshaw, but he's got into the Salford half. Irving looks for Austin. Austin's got it away to Sharp. Sharp has Gibson to beat. He stepped inside him. Sharp's going away. And the cheers from the scratching shed say that Henry Sharp scored in the corner. Henry Sharp coming on as a substitute, only a second touch of the ball. Scores in the corner, beating Gibson on the way. And the scratching shed erupts. season has given Halifax a two-point lead and Greg Pierce just on 
has taken over the goal kicking responsibility. The award goes to Henry Sharp of Halifax. Congratulations, Henry. There's your award. Certainly an inspirational second half by Halifax. Yeah, absolutely brilliant. We went in at half time, we played into a strong wind, we felt confident, we were all together. And we went out in the second half and just did the business. It was a marvellous performance. We've been threatening to do it for the last few weeks. We were unlucky at St. Helens going down by a couple of points, 30 28. We had a good win at home against Warrington, a good win at Wakefield, and uh, obviously a good win last week on Sky. And uh, we've been threatening to do it. We've come here today against a good side and done it. And I think we can go from here into the Premiership and continue it into next season. You're up to seventh now. I mean, that Premiership place, how important was that to Halifax? Well, very important, not just on a financial point of view, but uh, on a, a, an overall view of the season, because I think we've deserved to be up there. We've scored, I think, we're only second to Wigan on the point score in front, and we've got uh, our defence right. We did against Casford last week. We did here against Leeds. Obviously, play, players like Schofield and Hanley that can score from anywhere. And uh, once we've got that sorted out, I think we can go places. Hopefully, we can get above eight, so we don't have to go to Central Park. And I think we've got an excellent, excellent chance. That's great. Thanks for coming down, Henry. Thanks very much. Henry Sharp, man of the match. Leeds 16, Hanley and Gibson, four gallery.